Welcome to Illinois Rocks with your host Frank, coming in straight from Frank's basement where my wife has started her planting season and is very concerned on why her pepper seeds aren't started. For all of my <laughs> returning viewers, thank you for subscribing. If you haven't subscribed, please make sure to do so. Smash that like button and hit the notification bell so that you'll be notified of all upcoming videos. Pretty soon, there will be dozens of us. Dozens! There's nothing wrong with it. There are dozens of us. Dozens! Okay, so on today's episode, one of our tumblers has finished up its stage three tumble. So it's pretty much basically ready to be, basically its final riz. So we're going to be giving it a glow up of some polishing compound. So first we're going to start with emptying out that slurry and giving it a good wash. All right, so we have everything cleaned up here. Um, before we give them their final glow up, we, uh, we're gonna run them for a little bit with some borax, but we do have some lapis over here, some sodalite, um, we have a couple pieces of amethyst, um, some jasper over here, all kinds of really pretty rocks. So they look a little bit dull right now, but hopefully we'll get a really nice shine. But before we do that, we are gonna put them back in the tumbler with some tumbling media and some borax, run them for a couple of hours just to get all that, um, kind of burnish them a little bit before we go into that final polish, which is gonna last about 12 days. We have added our rocks back to our tumbler. Um, there's some cushioning media underneath. We're gonna add some more here. You don't wanna use fresh, especially for the polish. This has been used before, otherwise it's gonna be too sharp. So you want that barrel to be about two thirds full, especially since we're going into our final polish. So we're gonna add a little bit more in there. And then we're gonna add some of this borax here. Um, I don't know why it takes 20 mules to carry this. Um, if anyone knows, if you could drop me a note in the comments here and explain it to me. So I guess this is some kind of soap, but it was recommended. So we're just gonna measure until it looks okay. Looks pretty good to me. We're gonna add some water, stick it on the tumbler for a couple hours. And it is a gorgeous day, so we're gonna take our scooter out, catch some Pokemon, and check on it later tonight. Done rolling and time to tumble. All right, we're back and we're gonna see if the mules did their job and we got a big storm headed our way. So let's make sure we get everything all clean before we go ahead and add that polish. All right, as you can see here, we actually, uh, Looks like the mules did do their job. We got a little bit of suds here. Let's pour it on through. We shouldn't really have much slurry here, so we should be okay going down the sink. Although, I take no responsibility for what you do in your own home. Well, we'll go ahead and give it a good rinse. Then we'll load it back up and we will add in our polish. All right, I've still been experimenting with brands, but we've got our step four here which is supposed to be a 1500 grit aluminum oxide. Um, trying a couple different brands, but this is a kit that I got from Amazon. I also got some from Rock Shed that's supposed to be really good, but I figure I should try and use this up first. So we are gonna put in three tablespoons. Mm -hmm. All right, we're gonna add some water. Shake it back up a little bit. All right, we are gonna close it up and uh, then we're gonna check on this in about 12 days. So the timer on the rock tumbler only goes up to nine days. So we'll just set a reminder on the calendar and we'll see you then. <laughs> 